Welcome back to the channel and thank you for joining me in another episode here in Saturday Circuit guys this will be episode 5 by the way I put in here uh, this station just put it in and the uh, truck so I don't remember this one has two exits so let's just put it like that uh, straight if possible BAG that will be just amazing so mark to both of them these are the inputs we're not interested in inputs this is the fuel we're not interested in the fuel yet go in there so unload base okay we're gonna need to do the same stuff at the um, call no not, not at the call at the future uh, factory that we're gonna have steel factory Caterium I would like to bring it in here and I don't know maybe maybe we're gonna make um uh, can I think maybe we're gonna make the AI Demeters there you know we have two copper nodes in there which are normal i'm thinking grabbing one of them making copper sheets in there combine them with the criterium making their their yeah, limiters because in there we're gonna need that criterium in those copper sheets for the computers as well i don't know how the recipes are changed but i was thinking just to grab but it's gonna be tricky so our criterion is done in here the copper I think it's in here or in here in here I think it is dragging a bell down till here doesn't sounds like fun not at all but we could do that I don't know I'll, I'm still thinking about it nevertheless Today we're gonna make that uh, still magic happen. So we have three of these, that means 120. We have three of these, that means some stills and some beams in there, some pipes, whatever. We'll be able to bring those home with the help of a truck station and a tractor. Let's not forget that uh, we will need a little more. So we will need two for the iron, two of those. Uh, smet no, not smelters because we don't have the good recipe yet. So that's about it. Let's see. I'm missing portable miners too. I think I got them in here. Bingo. I have three of those. We're gonna need to overclock our miner for the coal just to have the coal necessary for the transport. I'm thinking first, let's do one single line. You know, like fill the truck in there, come with it in here, or come on foot, I don't know. Yeah, come on foot. Uh, start from here, go bring the take the caterium, then pass by there, take the steel beams and the steel pipes, and then come in here and deliver them. I've put in here the boxes. Now this is going to be very interesting how we're going to do it. Because we need smart splitting in here. So everything will be dumped in this, but we're going to need a decent in here, some smart splitting. Saying, well, we can use two outputs. So, yeah. Well, it's not gonna be ideal. Shoot. We could use three outputs. So we can have steel beams on one output. But we need the overflow as well. Yeah, it ain't good. It ain't gonna be good. These guys need to go away. Then we're gonna have to build in here to make some smart splitting happening. So, what am I missing? Yeah, limiters. Oh, um, why am I missing them? Probably didn't build them. Yeah. Okay, let's do that. Like, real fast. 
Um, I don't know how many. Two, three, four, eight, ten, eleven. Let's make them all. Because we're gonna need them all. How are we sitting with the power? Gotta take a look at that as well. Uh, power bomb. In here. Yeah, still. Oops. We got a hiccup in there. Wonder what it is. I don't know. Anywho. Uh, we were doing this stuff. So, we need smart splitting in here. And we need to sink the access, okay? So, we're gonna have Mark II belts coming this way. And we're gonna say like this. Um, let's keep these exits for the sinking. Yeah, I think so. So, let's put a Watson sinking here. Um, I need more of you. I would like to get up top if possible. Thank you. Already has power this way. Uh, what's some sink? Let's see in there. We're gonna need the merger in front of it. Okay, so we got power into that boy. It's working. Now, we're gonna have free products coming here. Guess what? We only have two exits. That's not ideal. Not ideal. Not idea at all. So how should we do this? Maybe we can have still steel, but what about Caterium? You know? Yeah, this ain't good. Sorry, didn't thought about it. Um uh, okay, so let's begin with this place. Left, I want let's make steel beam ahead pipe to the left quick wire okay copy paste okay now we're gonna need uh, are we gonna have more than 120 I don't think so what we could have for the quick wire nevertheless Um, even if we have it, it ain't gonna help with much. So, one in there, one in there, and one in there. Not enough space? Okay. So, uh, this one, and this one, come in here. Oh my god, that looks amazing. Gotta put it a little further away. Exiting forward, perfect. So this one for well, left, it's steel beams. This will be the steel beams, okay? Okay, so this, oh my god. That doesn't look good at all. Too steep. Well, I'm gonna leave it like that. That one has to be a mark. So, these are the beams going somewhere. I don't know where. Going ahead, okay? We're gonna need to have in here a smart splitter. Only mark two builds, remember. Okay, let's push it up there. Uh, same, ahead beams, whatever, to the right. Overflow. So my overflow of steel beams gonna come in there. Okay? And the steel beams will go in there. Good stuff. Let's take care of those beams. Uh, first, free space is gonna be this one. Let's leave this one for the quick wire and start with the beams from here. One, two, please. I needed to stop before that. Uh, I don't know the exact height. The exact height, so. I'm gonna do it like that. Mark 2. We said leave 1 for that. 
It's in here. Perfect. Uh, into that. Gracias. So those are the steel beams. Okay. That one has to go to the sink. Now we're gonna have to do the same thing with this limited space in here for each and every single exit. So we're gonna see in here. The head is going the steel pipes, okay? Steel pipes. Uh, let's bring it through that side. Okay, steel pipes. I remarked to you right now. Uh, smart splitting, please. In the front. Come on, you can do this. No, I didn't position it right. Uh, I need smart splitter, please. Smart splitter. In here? Doesn't really matter. Why not? I don't place this one right. No, it's exiting through this side. Okay. Not gonna modify it. Smart splitter. Okay. Mark two in here. Same to the right. Output any. The head none. To the left overflow. Okay, so overflow it's in there. Uh, mark the lift. Going up there. Okay, and now we're gonna have to put the pipes in. I think to the front it's a lot easier. So, there we are. Beautiful moth, what don't you mean? So, we need that guy connected to this guy. Will it reach? No, of course not. Well, let's just bring it somewhat straight in there. Perfect, it's clipping a little, don't really care about it. And now let's do the same stuff for the Caterium already. Uh, mark 2 always, because a lot of quantity in there. Perfect, I can delete those. Uh, let's go and set up the Caterium output, basically. Uh, exiting in the front, we said. Uh, we got a cave in there. It's my silly in there. Didn't went in there until now. Come on, you can do this. I believe in you. Let's delete that one as well. Make it new. Perfect. So, we're gonna cover the entrance to the cave. It's fine, I guess. Uh, special. Sink. Missing concrete. Always missing something. By the way, I was thinking about that dimensional depot. There's gonna be a literature in there because I don't think, I mean, think about it. It's a box, okay? Uh, you put it inside a box, something. You need a belt to put it inside. What if uh, you're putting everything that we have in here, let's say, and you're box gets filled up what then okay so my stack of let's say iron plates it's filled up okay if that one is filled up we're gonna have a little issue in there because the belt will be stuck and i will not be able to push these guys or this guys or that, those guys or whatever guys inside so I'm gonna have a little issue there. I think I need more plates. Um, and that makes me believe that we will need one of those dimensional depot. You know, the one that we're gonna have in here. For each and every single product type that we're gonna have. That means each and every single one of those outputs in there. Is gonna go to a dimensional depot so we're gonna have one for the caterium one for the steel plates beams one for the steel pipes 
one four one four one four one four one four one four one you know so it's gonna be a chore but it is what it is let's go and take care of that um iron so we got the iron up top in there dropping in that side okay so we need two miners in here one in there and one in here both going in the same direction excuse me for a second well we should really make that dash happen it's a sick and tail xeno zapper in here uh let's bring the power up in here um get one in there okay i don't think i'm gonna use this okay so we're gonna have mark ones coming in here um how should we do this well, let's put them on this side yeah let's put them in here i don't want to use mark the bounds because i don't have a bunch so we're gonna use mark ones for now it is what it is Okay, and these guys gotta come down in here. If they're gonna reach, they're not gonna reach. Amazing. We sit in here. And we need one of those stackables in here. Come on. Okay. In the middle, please. Stackable in there amazing now this boys all the 120 and this boy in here which apparently is kind of filled up which is just amazing will have to be merged on the line in here we're gonna have a small splitter in here oh my god i cannot make 120 shit i cannot make because that line in the back, it's only 120. Shoot. Uh, let's put that truck station in here somewhere. So that truck will come from there, there, I don't know where. It's gonna turn in here and load up in here, okay? This is the idea. This is gonna be called steel. Uh, maybe caps gonna be load perfect uh, we're gonna need a buffer of that in here right in the back and let's just fill it up I don't know exactly how much we're gonna need so hmm yeah this is gonna be really interesting in here uh it's gonna be really interesting because my build it's only 120 at this point yeah it's gonna be better but i wanted to do uh a setup a factory which makes 120. we're not gonna be able to do that we're not gonna be able to do that because the build it's 120 and we need something like i don't know how many in here for this stuff you know I don't know how, how much is gonna be needed but some is gonna be needed that's for sure it is what it is so let's put a smart split in here going from there is is this straight it's in the middle I think it is okay let's replace that one put it like that by now okay so a smart splitter the main will go that way with i don't know how much okay and that iron is gonna come in there so we're gonna need the merger for those two just to have one singular belt in here let's see just align with that it's gonna be in the wall well should have us 
mark one in there, mark one in there. I'm gonna come out the mark two. And let's start laying our foundries in here. Let me up. So from that way, that way. Let's put them like that. Yep, I think so. So 45 each, okay? That's 90. Uh, let's put three down. Gonna need our splitters in here. Uh, I feel like this one is way too close, but it's fine. So we're gonna need two splitters. One. And two. Gotta put them on levels. Because that's how they're beautiful. Did it there? There. And then we're gonna put beds inside there. Mark once for now. Sorry. Okay, mark two is in here. Perfect. Um, yeah, that looks shitty in there. Let's do it different. Manager, please. Amazing. Mark one in there. Mark one in the back, please. Perfect, Mark 2 in here. This will be our iron. Let me get rid of the iron that I have on me. End of the call, perfect. Uh, wait. So, how much? Let's say 20 for the transport. And we should make, well, normally this guy should be on 40. Okay. This guy should be on 40. And this guy is also on 40, 120, but we're gonna leave it on 20 for now. Just 100. We're gonna have a lot of excess of that 20, to be more precise. But we're gonna do the other thing. We're gonna go up there, grab our first miner, and say, make me only 40. Okay. Yes, it is what it is. 40, please. So we will be able to have a hundred steel ingots in here. I actually ain't much at all. But it is what it is. So this is my small splitter. It's gonna say to the right, because that's the entry. Right, okay. To the right, you're gonna send me the coal. Or any in this case. None in the front. And to the left, overflow. Let's go with that mark to build in there. Come on, they'll give him the chance to fill up. Uh, in the front? Let's go in the front of it. This time. Okay. So they'll give him up with that call. The overflow. Uh, mark one, more than enough. Should come straight in there. So. There's a the line in there. In here, it's a line. Good stuff. The overflow is gonna happen only when these boys are gonna be filled up with the coal. It's gonna be a minute, okay? Now, let's think about that 100 steel. What are we gonna do with them? Basically, we're gonna need beams and we're gonna need pipes. At the beginning, we're gonna need a bunch of those. Anyway, so 60, I wanna keep it like that. 20, yeah. So 90 until now, and we're gonna need another 10. So we're gonna do it like that. We're gonna merge this, because that's the way it's gotta be done. At some point, we're gonna have in here another free smelter, something like that, maybe, not maybe. For sure, we're gonna put some in the back as well. So let's merge them in here, send them this way and forward. This is the exit, merger please, my way. Perfect. 
merge it this way, merge it, sorry, this way, in here mark 1 is enough, mark 2, and mark 1 in there, exiting in here, so we're gonna need splitters in here, they're not exactly aligned center, uh, so this one will be a little crooked, it is what it is, well, I don't like it crooked, so let me delete these guys, change a little the arrangement here, make it go forward. Because that way I can make it straight. Okay. Uh, split it here. Entering that side. Uh, amazing. Mark 2, straight. Now it's straight, okay. Perfect. Constructors. We set three of them for now. Uh closer. Like that. One, two, and three. The first one will make the beams. Second one will make the pipes. Uh in here we're gonna need to have only ten. So divide by ten is six point sixty six, I think. In Indeed. Let's put this voice in. Come on, baby. All right, you guys. Yeah. That one's connected. This one's connected. It's getting here by that. This one is connected. Perfect. So we're gonna have twenty-six pipes, and we're gonna have. 15 beams. Oh my god, that's that's lousy. But it is what it is. Okay. Uh, I'm afraid that one will have to be a mark two as well. Oh, it is. Are you sure it is? Mark two. Mark two. Mark two. Um, oh, that guy was filled up. That's why it's barely moving. Yeah, well, we're gonna use them all. Don't worry about it. So we're making a hundred. Ah, they're not filled up with coal yet. That's why that one doesn't receive any. Not worried about it right now. Uh, this one is filled up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's gonna take half a millennia, but it's fine. Well, we have an excess of uh, 20, so it's good. This one is getting filled up first because it's only taking 20 per minute. This boy needs 40 per minute, so it's going to be the last one who's going to get filled up. It's fine. Okay, let's merge the pipes in here and send them forward. And those will go for it in there, all of them. So mark one because more than enough for what we need in here. Uh, in here, -ish, I believe. Okay. No, it's not in there, BAG. It's in here. Perfect. Those are our beams, and those will come in here. So, um, wait, one, two, in here we need one of these poles. Let's bring those pipes in. Uh, something like that, and then something like that, and then something like that. We get the beams and we get the pipes. We don't have the coal yet. Of course, that one is filled up because we set it up like that. Um, why aren't these guys moving and grooving? Like, mark two, mark two, mark two. Um, you know what? Let's make those mark two as well. 
that one really make it move. Because that one was not fast enough, let's say. Oh yeah, it was taking 60, it would have never get filled up in there. Mm-hmm, now it's gonna be fine. This one will have the possibility to get rid of all his inventory. Faster like. And this one the same. 100, yeah, I him. I mean, seeing that one, it's empty, perfect. So let's fill the first one. Good stuff. And now we'll have in here what we need. This one's taking 30, that one is taking 10. Amazing, almost filled up. It's gonna be balanced, perfect. So we get our pipe edge, we got our doors. That means we will be able to make our explorer because we have pipes. Uh, let's see, do I have everything I need? No, we don't have molars because we haven't built those. We could build... Um, Oscillators. But can we make motors yet? I wasn't aware of that. No, I cannot. Oh yeah, we can. No, we cannot. Okay, we need to unlock more stuff. Good stuff. So this one is kind of fixed in here. Uh, still no coal going into that side. This one is filled up. This one is getting filled up. Perfect. We're gonna have it at some point. Um, I think for the time being, we're gonna grab the Caterium and bring it in here. I will need in my inventory something like, I don't know, 200 of this? 100 for our tractor and 100 for... It's getting filled up. Yeah, it's gonna take a millennia, it's fine. Uh, so 100 for our tractor and 100 for our station back home. I don't know if I can put another station. I'm missing rollers. So, hurry back home. Grim Frank, let's put some fuel instead of it. Uh, in here, let's put our tractor in here. Our trip, let's call it, will begin from here. So, the other way around, perfect, let's fill it up, already did this once, that's why Ada doesn't talk with you, it said something really funny when I built that guy, that he doesn't spy on you, but don't you worry, you're being watched non-stop, you know, okay, so we're gonna need another truck station, oh, the criteria, let's go grab the rollers, Got a bunch. Um, we're gonna need all of those. Because do I have plates and concrete and wire and yeah, we have. Uh, let's see. I wanna put it I, I wanna put a mark on the map. In here. There's a factory in here, but the drop it's in here. Quick wire. Oops! <laughs> uh, we're gonna make it a factory. If I can find it, this guy. We're gonna make it um, green, just to see it. Infinite, yes. Or far. Far is more than enough. Perfect. And we have the steel in here. Let's make that one happen as well. Uh, caps, yes. Perfect. Another factory. Uh, green. We said. Fire. Okay, so. Still works. Quick wire. Okay, let's go for the quick wire because that's what we need right now. So I want to have that platform, um, well, all of this could be modified because I decided to bring down, yeah, we'll bring down the product, 
uh, but wait. It was more than 120? I think so. So I want to bring it down with a 4 meter ramp and put it like in there. Not in those rocks because it's going to be a pain. So I want in there. Uh, my drop point basically yeah let's see what do we have in here because I don't remember it's been a minute okay yeah we have two boxes two belts both marked two. oh my god okay uh, two belts marked two how, how much of that I have 127, 227. Let's hope it's gonna be enough. Okay, so I don't wanna sit in this rock because I don't have novelists. Well, actually, we could put a uh, dead truck station in here just like that. No? Shit. Ah, Fluffy wants to play. Okay, truck station we send in here ish, doesn't really matter where. Uh, gonna need the power in here. Of course, too long. Uh, inputs, inputs are in here. Are we gonna need to bring those mark to belt? Good stuff, so. All this bunch of Caterium will make his way in there. Uh, at some point, all of that is going to get filled up. And this will need to be seen, but that is going to happen at the base. Yeah, I'm going to need Mark IV belts for this soon enough. Anyway, we fixed this one. Uh, so this one is quick wire here. It's set on load. Perfect. I don't have fuel for you. It's gonna be fine. Let's get to the steel and see uh, basically what is the track that we're gonna take. Okay, so I've cleaned the scenery a little. I think we can scooch that the truck through here. Through here. Ideally it will be through here. Let's make ourselves some uh, just to know where to go. We'll come from Derish somewhere. We can scooch it through here. Like this. Is a place that I can pass? Yes. Ah, come on, let me be. Jesus Christ, it didn't scare me, okay? Where are you? Get your butt in here. Fluff your butt. Okay, so I'm gonna have to pass through here with that truck. Come through there, come pass through here. Okay, get up on this. Pass through here, drop through here. Somehow, in here, that rock, it's exactly where it shouldn't be. This one is set on load, perfect. We get some stuff moving and grooving. The coal is coming. Amazing. And uh, then we're gonna go through here, I think. Somehow. I don't know how. We'll see. We'll see how this one goes. Worst case scenario, I bring it here. That truck station. Which it ain't gonna be a bad idea to do now, but I don't have the mark to belt here. Or the mark ones. I don't know. I don't want to put a million belts in there. 
and then we're gonna make it to the base. Good stuff. I think we are ready to record the path that we need to take with our truck. Yep, we can do that. Let's go. If we remember how to do it. Okay, so this boy has a fuel. Perfect. Uh, record menu. Start recording. This is our the start of our path, okay? Perfect. We're gonna come in here. Uh, yep, yeah, already been off unload because I'm way too close. That's why. Gonna wait for that one to finish. Good. Let's go to the Caterium now. It's all the way in the right, but we're gonna get down through here anyway. Because believe it or not, these arrows will help me find a way back. Uh, easy, right? Uh, yeah, well, a little off-road adventure didn't kill anybody, anyway. We had 90 to call, believe it or not. Okay, let's, let's slow it down a little here. Yeah, here we go, load it. With a quick line. It's finished, let's go. Uh, a bunch of rocks in here, not ideal, but we made it somehow happen. Okay, at some point, we must not follow this, but go to the... to those grids, directly there, exactly for this. So, pass through here, we're gonna go back in the delete afterwards. This is an easier path. Oh, because of those pesky rocks, no, these pesky rocks. Of course, this truck will fly through here, but, oh my god, we don't really care about it. We're gonna delete that node in there. F. We're gonna delete some of those nodes. Okay, let's get out of here. If we can, finish. Um, that was not supposed to happen. Oh my god. We won't have a lot of nodes to delete, you just put it in there. Yeah. Okay. Through here. That's why I don't want to come through here. And then, somehow, like that, it's gonna make quite fine to see that guy teleporting from one place to another to try to follow those signs. Uh, it is what it is. I ain't gonna do it again, I'm just gonna edit it. Okay, so as soon as we reach this point, the track is finished. Okay, safe path. Uh, base run. Uh, Caterium, so quick wire. And still. Safe. Okay, is the current vehicle path? Enable the pilot. Get down. He should go. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, um, delete this node. Yes. Uh, delete this node. Yes. In here, I want to edit how long it stays in here, but I don't remember how to do that. Uh, in here. Wait, 10 seconds, perfect. So now, all our products, normally they should be dropped out there, and they are. Of course, that boy is filled up only a Mark II belt. Apparently some idiot put that one on only Mark one. Jesus Christ. Let me grab some more of this stuff, because if not, everything is getting synced. It is what it is. Pleasures of life. Okay. Is that one a mark? It is. Perfect. Is that one? It is. That one is a mark too. We get the pipes moving and grooving. We get that. Uh, what about the quick wire? Is going through there? Maybe. Perhaps. Mark two. Mark two. Mark two. That one is mark two. That one it is. That one it is. We get the quick wire. We get the steel beams. We get those. Okay. Let's take care of this one really fast. So. Ended up through here. Let's see that this one is good. Way too many in here. Did it that node? It's gonna come through here, go in there. Perfect. Let's follow his path. I don't know what the noise is. I don't like it. Okay. Uh, it happens from time to time when I press shift. I don't know. Yep. That happens quite often, I may add. We can delete this node in here because it's extra. Perfect. 
Uh, okay, let's get true here. Uh, that one will not be needed anymore. Because it's just gonna make it. Oh, uh, 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 uh. What happens? It hit me, but it didn't kill me. Okay, so it comes through here, goes through there. I wanna delete really fast this node in here, because this is not good for it. his health. And this one. That will come in here, go up through here. <laughs> Gotta delete all the scrap in here. He will find his way. He will teleport himself. Right here. Even if he's getting stuck into a stone, he will find his way, don't worry. As long as you are here watching, it ain't gonna be nice. Otherwise, <laughs> trust me, it's gonna find its way. Okay, from one node to another. Even through all these amazing rocks that we cannot destroy here. Uh, yeah, this is gonna be pretty funny. Hi there. Uh, ignore him. Okay, ignore him. Let's continue with the schedule. Now he's stuck. Trust me, he won't be for long. Delete that. Delete this because I want him to find his way from there in there by itself it's already unstuck guess what it's on his way home good stuff coming through here that one is not needed in there just polluting the scenery let's get to the Caterium and see the notes what we've done in here so we went up in here through here okay yep looks pretty good Come on, come on this. Again? Didn't be. Yep. Looks really good. Perfect. Well, this boy is getting filled up in here. Yep. Let's go back home. Um. So, we need... What do we need, my friend? Because uh, I don't remember. We need the bash here for this idiot. Let's make it happen, like, now because if not i'm gonna forget about it again when we're gonna have no obelisks uh, i think we're gonna follow this path again and remove basically everything that we don't like like stone stuff yeah for the time being this is fine hi there man oh uh, where was it those could be good as well um not in here idiot or the research thing. Did we? No, we didn't. Oh, it's minus one. Sorry. So, this one. Enhanced Asset Security. We're gonna need a hundred of those. Oh, I think I have a hundred. We only have 20. Any left in there? Psst, eight. That's nothing. Okay, so 200 more of this stuff. 200 for me. Uh, another 1000 something of this, so I'm gonna grab three stacks and all of this basically. Come on, we're gonna need another 50, so this ain't gonna be enough. Uh, how is this one going here? That Ethereum is barely moving. Mark 2, Mark 2, yeah, because only Mark 2 in here, even if we have two outputs, that one. All of it should be a mark free. It is mark two, but it is what it is. Let's remember that in there we have two mark twos. This one acts as a buffer right now. It is what it is. The best that I can do is grab it all and put it in here until we're gonna have mark freeze. Or, you know what? Let's do it different. Uh, no, first the basher. Let's deposit what we have in here. For said basher, gonna need another 24. Fine, that'll be done. Uh, let's go to the Caterium. Um, stop one of those bells. Leave only one. Well, actually, the same stuff. 
I was thinking just to leave only one of those belts in. You don't have a lot of stuff on you, my friend. What happened to you? Oh, already done? Yeah, already done. So, I was thinking just to sink one of those Caterians lines out of there. But it's gonna be the same stuff because the issue is not in there or transporting. The issue is in here getting rid of them really fast. We don't have the necessary speed to do that. Listen, look at them, they're struggling, okay? But I don't know why this one ain't pushing the A. Oh, because that one, yeah. So it's coming 120, going out 120, but even though we have to exit, it's still barely crawling. So at this point, that one, it's for nothing, basically. With all of this crap, we are using only that guy. If we would have had Mark III, yes, we will have Mark III soon enough. Nevertheless, uh, steel beams. That's the material needed for Mark III. Bring you guys back when we're gonna have 24 of this. Kind of tempted to make him by hand but I'll resist that temptation so I have the rest of the templates perfect basher coming up milestone reached the xeno basher is a direct upgrade from the xeno zapper in the words of the engineer that first developed this tool quote the zapper kind of electrocutes things, the basher straight up smacks stuff, while also electrocuting them." Unquote. It is beneficial during encounters with aggressive fauna, and has been tested thoroughly. The engineer's noble sacrifice for Xeno research will not be forgotten, whoever they were. <laughs> they know their words, but nothing else. <laughs> it doesn't really matter. We got our Xeno basher, we need two of them, so we need to make... I had to make another Xeno Zapper. Finally, we got the Xeno Basher. Looking just outstanding, you know. Your hands pass through the death key, mister. That's not something. Um, visual bug in there. So, we made it happen. Oh, we don't have the Explorer because we don't have the engines, the motors, I wanna say. We made the quick wire and the smart splitter. And we're gonna, we made a lot more than that, okay. For the next episode, I wanna get Mark free Logistics, and uh, let's see what else. Ah, you see, I hate it. That's what I always do. MK free Logistics. Ah. You see, I hate it. That's what I always do. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, you gotta click on that. Idiot. Let's close like that. Good stuff. Oh my god. Watch out. I'm coming for you guys. All the hugs will be dead. So we finished day free. Amazing. Oh, oh, we need those blueprints like yesterday. I think we kind of have all that. We need the logistics, nevertheless. That's the first thing. Uh, we don't have reinforced time points. Uh, yeah, we're gonna need that to happen. So that will give me the storage. I don't care about that. That and that, yes, they're just outstanding. This will be our first milestone. After that, we're gonna start doing uh, blueprints first. I'm not gonna import my old ones. No, I'm gonna do new ones and that's it. Um, so, 400 of those, Jesus Christ, it's gonna be a minute. You know, to make it faster, I wanna stop this boy. So, stop, because plenty of modular frames in here. Grab the egg belt, grab a container put it in here because in that place I'm only making four 
But guess what? In here we're making another 375. We're gonna just plop it in there. And because I don't want these guys to ever stop, we're gonna take those. Uh, okay, let's sink them, you know, just bring them, I don't know, in here, and sink them, because I don't need this in my life, okay, I just don't, okay, and everything in here will continue functioning as intended, more or less, uh, take those as well, come on, I know you want it, I know you can do it, oh my god, another one entry. No, no, I didn't. Sorry. Okay. Uh, now I'm gonna have a little more plates in here. Four in there and uh, free something that's almost eight per minute is gonna go a little faster. It's gonna be just fine. Uh, nevertheless, we're gonna leave this episode in here because it's kinda long. I feel like we accomplished a bunch of stuff today. We have still incoming. We already have some stuck in there. 491 beams, 960 of those amazing pipes. I think we should uh, kind of change the arrangement in there because we're gonna need more beams for the beginning. Maybe I'll go and do that by myself. And we made uh, our first uh, tractor automation magic in here, which is just outstanding. I'm loving it. We have a good tool in here just to play with those idiots, which is just amazing. I'm not so much afraid of them now. So I think we did pretty good. I'm gonna go and modify the reeds in here just to have more beams be made because Mark free belts are a must. Uh, and for the time being, we're not gonna be able to make reinforce steel beams with pipes because we don't have the recipe we need to go and explore in order to have the recipe so i think i'm gonna do the right thing and make some molders at hand with pipes with wires we're gonna make the stators and after that we're gonna make um well i can leave these guys like this for now we can make the motors in the crafting bench, of course, because we only needed something like 10, I believe. 5. That's not 10 stators. Comes really fast. So, this one is taking 30 to make 20. And this one is taking 10 to make 6. So, we have 26, but we only have 15 of this. Hmm. How should we do this? This one's taking 60 to make 15. You know what? Let's put this one to the max in here. 30. Okay. And we're gonna use another 30 in here. To make this guys. You can have those. Thank you. 30. So 7.5. That means... Yeah. We're using it here 60, 90, and 30, 120. Is this good enough? I think so. Uh, or we were making only 100. I think we were making only 100 in here. 20, 20, 100. Oh my god. So it's not good. 19 here we're gonna need to have only 10 uh that's too low not good not good not good so let me let me see again 16 uh we're gonna drop this one a little more uh five okay so 80 and then here 20. 15 maybe 14 I said. 13. 25. 33. Yeah, something like that. So we're gonna have our consumption is gonna be balanced. 
we're gonna make 13 pipes, that's not much, and 20 beams, but I feel like this is a good ratio for the beginning. How much, um, where was I saying? Um, here the stop sign. No, where was I saying the trucks? The, the routes, I wanted to see. Uh, I don't know, on the map? Truck stations. I want to see the trajectory of this idiot and how much it takes. Uh, yeah, I know you're stuck, buddy. Not to drive. Open. Yeah, it already teleported away. That's what it happens. So I wanted to see. Oh, in here. But it doesn't say no. Eight per minute. Remember, minute per minute. It doesn't say for this route in here. I think I gotta build another one. I don't have the plates with me. Uh, we gotta build another one. Let's see. Uh, do I have screws on me? Uh, I will not do that. Perfect. Okay, decided. Ooh, I gotta see how much... Um, coal it's using. That's the idea. Because if it's not using... 20, if it's using something like 5, 8, I can ramp up this production in here. Because this boy looks like it's filled up, it's barely consuming any, and it's backing up. You know what, we'll do something else. I'll leave it on, no, I'll leave it like this until everything is clear because I'll forget about it otherwise. So, I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do in here, but I'm gonna do something, and then play with the numbers again. And that guy is filled up. It's not moving. So not only that its consumption is going on stop, but it filled up those two three hundred that I took because it was one hundred in this station, one hundred home, one hundred in the tractor. So it filled those three hundred up, and now it's filled up. So I will do something else. I will. Uh, put this one on 40 in here. 40 I said. We're gonna have 120 full production like we wanted. And um, I don't know, I'm gonna modify this guys again. In here somehow. So 60. 120. This one gotta consume 20, perfect. That means we're gonna make 13 pipes and 15, 30 beams. I think that's good, honestly. Amazing, isn't it? We're gonna have more beams, perfect. Well guys, this episode is long enough. I need to unlock some stuff in the Wasm shop. I think we're gonna do that one together. So we're gonna leave this one in here. Tell me if you wanna see something specific then in satisfactory in here. Let me know down in the comments. If not, gonna continue my normal, usual schedule, let's say. Uh, looking forward of playing with uh, blueprints. Gonna put a blueprint machine somewhere in the, in the center and start making blueprints in the next one, of course. This one, as I already said, pretty long, excuse me for that, it is what it is. Thank you guys so much for being here for watching this. If you like it, don't forget to leave a like on the video, subscribe on the channel if you haven't, and if you want to see more. And if by any chance you want to support my dream of becoming a full-time content creator, you can do that by grabbing yourself an amazing membership. Thank you again, I'll see you in the next one. Take care of you all.